Pokemon was still very unknown or unheard of at that time, I realized that I miss teaching and children and didn't realize that would be the pioneer staff of Kumon in the Philippines along with two ladies, Beth and Dainty. Nag-start ako sa story ko sa Kumon ito. Since na may background naman ako sa logistics, yun, I tried to apply. I took over a 10-year-old center. As a new instructor, I had to learn everything all at once. Actually, I wasn't planning on becoming an instructor <laughs> at the start because I can see her hard work, how she dedicated my mom is with being an instructor. But it's just when I went to the center and I really felt the connection with the center. Parang when I got there, parang I want to try this out. That's how I felt. I got enrollment sa Kumon as my birthday gift. <laughs> and then <laughs> there, I was entered into the, into the program. I saw an ad for a Kumon franchise in a child magazine way back when Vicky was only around two years old. And I kept that magazine because that magazine ad struck me because it says, these kids will score 100% when they go back to school. How about your kids? Our major challenge then was how to introduce Kumon to people. So we had to conduct a lot of orientations at the office and in different schools and locations. I even remember attending an orientation in Pampanga and people were giggling. One of them said that Kumon means toilet in their dialect. So I had to give them the real orientation about the Kumon method of learning. What inspired me to stay in Kumon? There's always only one reason for me, it's the children. Every day we get to see them improve little by little. Sometimes they want to give up, they want to quit the program, but when you talk to them, they try again. When you check back on their progress from like a month later and see how much they've improved, that's what inspires me to stay. Whenever a parent would come to me, Teacher Eileen, thank you for helping my child do this and do that. Those are small things that would actually make me wake up in the morning and do my thing because I know that I've touched lives in Kumon. What kept me going through Kumon was the fact that they teach you to always strive to become a better version of yourself. It doesn't just teach you lessons in math and reading, it teaches you to always improve yourself on what you can do right now in every aspect, whether it be academic or non-academic. Number one talaga ang tumatak sa akin, no? Hanggang ngayon, yun, ang tutunan ko sa mga Japanese uh, boss, no? Yung punctuality. Five minutes earlier, on yun ang on time. When you're a classroom teacher, they all have to follow what you want to do. If they're absent, so you don't care. But in Kumon, it's a different ballgame altogether because here, it's the student who is at the center of everything. It's not you anymore as the teacher, it's the student. And can you believe it here in Kumon, it's a five-year-old who will decide if she or he wants to continue with the program. So that's really a lesson in humility. Because of my training in Kumon, I was able to develop a mentality that there is always room for growth, even if it takes a longer time before you can achieve that. And that also helps me focus. Kumon was able to teach me to become more disciplined. I would like to say that all my experiences Kumon are life-changing. All the challenges, all the frustrations, all the good and the bad that goes with the territory, all the rewards that Kumon has given me, all of this uh, contributed to who I am today. Bakit ko enroll ang mga anak ko sa Kumon? Kasi mahal ko sila. Mahal ko yung mga anak ko. Gusto ko kasi lang maging ano, uh, smart. Importante sa'yo mag-asawa yung education. Over the past years, many people have come and have gone away. But by and large, it's Kumon's integrity, value, and effectiveness that made it thrive and develop and continue to grow. And that makes me so proud and honored to be part of this institution because I'm surrounded with brilliant instructors and staff members. All stories of our children in our center 
is a concrete manifestation of Mr. Toro Kumon's vision of maximizing the potential of every child. The thing about Kumon is that you never really get to complete the program even after that completer's test. Because the very essence of Kumon, which is to always strive to become even better than yourself, is a never-ending art. And I hope Kumon Philippines teaches this lesson to even more students as it grows even further.